out and about in the Roseville area, but he has, he's been working on his backyard. I have been intrigued wow. to see how it's coming along. Are you done Such with it yet, Dave? Court, you know what? I, more than anything, I get inspiration from all the stuff that we do on our show. I mean, I was at oh. Green Acres the other day doing a live shot with Ashley, mm. and we do stuff with Michael Marks and Marlene, right. the plant lady. So with COVID going on and the gym shut down, I just figured, you know what? I'm going to spend more time out in my yard. Here, let oh me get my God, camera, man. and I'll kind of show you mm. around a little bit with, with what I've done. It looks it's been fantastic. been an ongoing project for the last it's couple nice. months. It's very so. relaxing. It's got a very Thanks. zen feel to it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, thanks. Now, believe me, if I can do it, anybody can do it because really, I'm, <laughs> I, like I said, I just take a lot of ideas that we show on our show and pick people's uh, brains and their minds and what they do. And so, like, I have some citrus trees over here. Very dry. And then friendly. I just did some nice. rock and some little wood. Grass, yeah, did you do all that rock yourself? yourself? I asked a lot of questions. What's that? Did you do all that rock yourself? Was that in there before? Or did you bring that in and put it down yourself? No, no, I put I I brought in all the rock. So mm -hmm. yeah, and then I and then uh, Tina, the you know, yard. Tina does a garden in her backyard, and she had been right. talking to me. So I thought I can build a garden. So I just built a little blocks out of uh, redwood, two by twelve and two by fours, and all of a sudden the garden just took off. So what are you growing that, in? Then off in that direction, I have. Uh, I have a peach tree over in that direction. I have a plum tree in that direction. So, and then me and my son Matthew built this uh, this little structure here. Wait, Jeez. you built that? So, I have some before pictures. You want to see what it looked like? Uh, yeah, beforehand? we're looking at it now. Before I started this. Oh wow. Oh okay. Yeah. So. Well, yeah, you really so did I have a lot. shed there. Just a shed with, of course. Yeah, just uh, tools, a lawnmower, a weed eater, that type of stuff. And then just without being able to go to the gym, I'm like. All right, time for the shed to go. Time to Holy put in, cow. you know, some of the I'm things I've seen on Good Day to You. So that's, you put that's in what some I did. Work, so I have to bring. Uh, yeah, it's been a lot of uh, hard work, but it's therapeutic in a way. You get off Good Day and then yeah. come back. Look at this. Look at this. Well, one of you guys eat this. <laughs> this is what I grew. I don't know <laughs> when the, when you're supposed to pick this stuff. <laughs> it looks like a you medieval know, so weapon. That's like a z bludgeon somebody with that. <laughs> And then I'll, br I'll okay. bring you guys some pluots because I've actually these are some these are some pluots off the tree. I'll bring oh, you some. They're really tasty. Pluots. Okay, so Dave, I think I have another project for you. Mm -hmm. With with your squash, your when house. they get that big, yeah. they might make better zucchini bread as opposed to trying to eat it, you know, oh. in salad, stir fries and stuff. So that's like maybe that's court? your next thing to start baking. Court. That's what my wife Michelle said. I'll make some zucchini bread with that. <gasps> so on Monday, actually, we're going to be we're, we're going to have a segment where we're actually we want to see people's home projects. And so if you're out in the yard working this weekend, make sure to take some pictures and share them with us on Monday so we can see what uh, the viewers did. I'll be sure to share a picture it. of me half-heartedly mowing my lawn. <laughs> <laughs> Dave, that is fantastic. I'm, I'm so excited for you because it looks great. Nice place to hang out too. Thanks, Corey. It really turned out nice. Yeah. A little zen garden. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Hey, on. Prompters catching mm -hmm. up. Okay. Yes. After loading. Mm -hmm. uh, music is healing for both fans and the artists. Yes. How musicians are using time during quarantine to release some new singles coming up. Plus, this is so cool, guys. A rare opportunity.